Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. I hope everybody is having a fabulous day today. If you are into baggies just as much as I am, then you're going to be obsessed with my channel, so don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And if you want to bug you almost every single day, hit that little bell so you can miss any of my coming videos. You can also follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. And... Yeah, let's get this party started. I forgot what I was going to say. Lip gloss of the day is this is Jeffree Star, the gloss in the color Legends, which is a clear kind of nude shade. I have been using this a whole bunch. I'm down to here, it looks like. So, pretty soon I'm going to have to open up another little thing. Okay. So, lots of drama is going on. All over, everywhere. It's just like totally crazy. I have had it. I... I need to respond to this. Hold on. She... <laughs> oh, I got it. Okay. <laughs> Instagram drama. Not involving me, but I decided to include myself. And by include myself, just comment on a nasty comment to one of my YouTube friends. In Instagram friends. So, I just... I don't know what's going on, but I've just, like, had it with these psycho people. Like, just stop it. Just stop. It is out of control. It's completely out of control. Like, all these fake accounts all over Instagram, fake bags, fake, you know, those, um, I don't know, what's WeChat, and is that what it's called, or Money Chat, uh, whatever. Like, all that fake, fake bag selling stuff, like, I got, like, there's, like, a situation. I'm, like, a mess right now. I don't want... I just had a chat. We just had a talk for a minute. Let's talk about the bag. So. Okay. In a moment. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. It is just so... Like, it's so insane. It is so insane. I, I get mess... I get emails all the time. I get, like, Instagram um, DMs and stuff from, like, these fake bag people or, like, random, like, collab video thing. Like, I... Like, I don't know who you people are. But you need to get out of me, you need to leave me alone, and you're bugging me. You, you're you reported, you're blocked, just stop it. Just stop. It's like... <sighs> Instagram needs to get it together and get rid of these accounts because it's insane. It's borderline, like, harassment when I'm getting emails, like, constantly. It's like, it's weird. It's just very weird. I don't like it. Or DMs, and, they're, and it's like the same kind of, like, people... And my other YouTube and Instagram friends are getting the same thing. And it's just bizarre. It's like we're being harassed, like, from these replica companies or something. I don't even know, because I just report them and then immediately block them. I don't even, like, clap back. But this was funny, so I decided to. Anyway, Longchamp is still having a sale. This is this sale is still going on. Just like this Maltese hair that is still attached. I think I got it all. Okay. Um... So the Longchamp sale is still happening right now. And they've added even more. Like, there's even more. It is completely... I have gone absolutely crazy again with Longchamp and added so many bags. I I need to be stopped <laughs> because it's out of control. So one of the bags that I picked up, I... I um, well, it's in the thumbnail. I'm just show, here you go. So here it is. So this is the... Uh, Wait, is this mini? Yes, Mi mini, mini Le Pliage in the LGP in the silver glazed lambskin. That's what this is. And it's very, um, it's interesting. So I would have never paid the full retail price for this, but I got, what did I get, 50% off? Something like that. And I thought, well, I don't have any silver bags in my collection. And I love Longchamp. It's just my thing. Like, I just, I, I, I'm obsessed, <laughs> clearly. And this, this particular size, I have like, gosh, oh my gosh, did you just notice the robe? I haven't worn this in a minute. Okay, so, I was playing with my puppies, so my husband and I were just running, around, I don't know, we're just like crazy dog people. Okay, and there's lots of wrinkling under here. I just noticed that. But that that is just normal with this type of leather. So I would have not paid, like, the regular price for this, of course. But I love this style. I like the size. It's very functional for me. There's some things I don't like about it, but I said that, I think, about another one. The strap that came with it. It's just, like, a little longer than this 
handle. So it's kind of weird. Uh, I have a strap that I brought down, which I'll be using with it because I, I do want to use it. But I thought it'd be kind of fun to have this. I love, like I said, I love the style, the size, so it's totally my vibe. And I thought, well, if I'm gonna have a silver bag, this this will be it because it's small and it's, you know, it holds plenty and it's LGP and I love the LGP. It's so cool. It's basically like a mirror. It's like a freaking mirror. It's really neat. The bottom is just like the, the mirror. I mean, you can see the ring light. Look at that. You can just see the ring light in there. It's pretty funny. So it's very interesting feeling and it's doing what I thought it would do and I haven't even used it. So it's getting really wrinkly um, and that is definitely why I would not pay full price for this. Like under, I don't know if you can see underneath the handle here. Like, you know how the Louis Vuitton bags do that with the Bichette, which they shouldn't by the way. But anyway, they do this kind of like wrinkling situation under here. So it's doing that. And that is just because it's this like patented like lambskin and it's all wrinkled here. And I, like I said, I haven't even used it. See this wrinkle, wrinkle, wrinkling. I'm just, I'm a little worried about that cracking. We'll see how it goes. I'm sure Longchamp will take care of me if that does happen. Um, I would assume that they'll just replace it or give me credit or something like that because I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. And I'm speaking when I don't even know anything. <laughs> But I just wanted to share, because it's very different. It's kind of like a, I don't know, it kind of looks like a little disco ball almost. Because it's like, is this like showing up? So like the LGPs, it's all shiny. And then like, it's like a matte underneath. I don't know. It's like really, it's, it's not embossed. It's like, it's debossed. It's a debossed coated lamb leather. I know, it's really weird. It is really weird. Okay, let me just show you the inside. So it's got silver hardware, little top handle things. It's got these two. This one is made in France, by the way, which is interesting. You got these two hooks here for a strap, which it's detachable, which is great. I love detachable. I have so many bags and so many straps that it doesn't even matter. Like, I'll just steal a strap from something else. But this is the dumb strap it came with. It's so dumb. It's just like the other one. The transparent one that I have, it's just this little, I mean, this is not much taller than the, than the handle. Like it's, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. Long shot, I don't, I don't really get it. I, I don't, I don't get this. Like I legitimately don't understand. Okay, well here's like the back side of the leather. So it's like the silvery gray. And then this is the shiny like coated. I don't even know. Like. It's so weird, I guess. Okay. And then the inside is the LGP. Or not LGP. Sorry, it's not LGP. It's just, it's the old style. The, um, the crisscrossing situation. So there is like the inside. It's got one slip pocket. And then on the tag, it just says on the, on the care blanket thing that it says lambskin trimmed with cowhide lining textile. So it's just some weird coated, honestly, like plasticky feeling. I don't want to use the word disappointed, but I feel like they could have done a little bit better on this one. Maybe they tried some other techniques and, and this just came out how they envisioned it, how, how it, for it to look. Um, I'm just not really sure about the integrity of the type of coating and material on it for long term. It's it's a cool bag, like it's definitely something that's different, and I didn't have this, so, eh, you know I'm crazy, whatever. Okay, so let me show you the strap I brought. I actually was just playing around with this different straps. I was like, I was like legit, like trying them on in the mirror checking out like different like thickness thick ones cotton ones you know canvas ones and i found this one and this strap is actually from my what is it off of it's off of my longchamp um mini le pliage heritage uh khaki and black that's what this is so this is a a black uh like black smooth calf leather 
uh, strap, and this fits me crossbody. So let me like here. Let's just do like a quick thing. So it's twenty four inch drop. That's what the strap is on here. So I just wanted to show you that because I thought the I wanted to try different straps and then look at them on me to kind of figure out the proportions. And I, you know what's kind of funny? I had a duff different strap on there that was shorter and it rode up really, really high, you know, like a really high, really high crossbody. that look. Uh, it didn't look right with my outfit today, so I'd have to have the right outfit on to make that kind of work where it's a really high crossbody. But I actually kind of liked it like that. It looks, it's just, I don't know. There's, it's just, it's a, it's a vibe. It's like a situation. Okay, let me show you the strap. Let me just put it on here so you can kind of like figure it out. It's really, that's why I love having all these different straps because then you can just find one that's perfect, you know? So, how are you guys? Okay, so here's like how the strap looks like on it. Okay, I'm like getting all twisted up. So you can kind of see what I mean. So there, like, you get it? See, like, I feel like the proportion of the thickness of this strap, because it's, it's a little thicker than this one that came with it. You can see that there. But it's still, like, proportioned properly, where it's, it doesn't look funny. Like, it looks good on. I had a really thick, thick cotton strap on here, too, which, it looked okay, but I liked, I just, I don't know, I just felt like this looked a little bit better, and I like the black. I don't have a silver, so I just really like the black. Uh, strap on it and I think it works. I think it'll I think it'll work. It'll be fun to wear and I'm definitely gonna wear it I think this will be good one for even honestly like the winter and In the snow and rain. We'll see. I'm just a little worried about this creasing situation. I don't know what to think about it You know what I mean? Like I just I don't know I'm just worried if that's gonna end up cracking the coating on there But we'll find out Okay, and another thing is, I thought this would be really fun for like the holiday time, for like Christmas and stuff, because it's like a little disco ball, and then it also reminded me of like a Christmas ornament, because it's a silver shine. I don't know, it's ridiculous. Do you guys remember that one Chanel that I had? The Chanel, uh, I bought that Chanel reissue, 255 and the 226 size, I ended up returning it because it just, it sat up too high for that size of the bag. It just didn't look right on me. I just I just returned it. But anyway, so this is the shiny situation we're going on. And I this is way too long. I'm getting off. Goodbye. We're done. Thank you for watching. I do appreciate it. There's a lot more from where this came from. And I didn't do a vlogging thing today. But I just wanted to talk about that IG stuff for like a moment. And everybody's lost their minds. And I just, just like, just shut up and sit down. Okay. Thank you for watching. I may have had another Arby's orange cream shake. My husband did too. We both went and got him. Anyway, uh, if you enjoyed this video, <laughs> give it a thumbs up, I guess. And until next time, you guys keep it tight. Talk to you later. Bye.